One of the first things that you need to do when you get your bicycle engine kit is adjust the CDR unit. Now as it happens because the CDR unit is sent over to you from a long way many many miles away by the time it gets to you some of the connections especially on the CDI base and also on the plug boot become loose if they become loose what will happen is you'll install your engine kit and you'll be troubling troubleshooting everything else without realizing that it's just the connections here that are causing the problem so basically we're going to discuss today what you need to do and exactly how you're going to do it so the first thing that we need to do is unscrew the cable from the base of the CDI unit so all I do is I take it and unscrew it counterclockwise and what will happen is it will eventually come out okay and then what you also need to do is exactly the same thing at the plug boot connection so what you do is you unscrew it counterclockwise until it comes out completely there you go so we've got the CDI base here and the plug boot here okay so what we're going to do now is take some wire cutters or take a wire cutter and cut approximately I'd say, uh, I'll just zoom in a bit so you can see that there we go if we get this out of the way for a second and what we're going to do is cut approximately five mil about, I'd say about ten millimeters from each end so here we go I'm going to cut ten millimeters from this side and I'm going to turn the cable over and I'm also going to cut five millimeters from this side as well so here it goes that's another five, uh, ten millimeters there so I've got ten millimeters off that and then what we're going to do is we're going to screw it back into the base of the plug boot okay so here's what it's really simple I mean you I don't think you can actually see it here but there's a screw inside here and all it is the wire screws onto the screw so here we go okay so we take that and we just twist it keep twisting and you'll know you've gone far enough because you'll get to a point where you can't twist anymore there you go, that's done okay then what we do is get the CDI base and screw the other end of the wire into the screw I think you can see the screw here yep um, in the CDI base so that's what we're going to do now Again, keep screwing until it goes as far as it will go and then it will stop. And you'll know you've gone far enough because you won't be able to screw anymore. Okay, just get the ends out of the way. and there you have it so as soon as you get your bicycle engine kit make sure that this is the first thing that you do because it will save you a lot of headache and a lot of trouble later on this is Andy 
on behalf of TransformerCycles.com signing out.